Hello, my name is John Winters and I want to talk to you for a few minutes about the higher level maths revision courses that will be taking, that will be taking place in Ashley College over the Christmas period. First of all, we have two goals with the revision course. Goal number one is to make sure that students are able to complete basic questions in the main subject areas on paper one and paper two, which would be algebra, differentiation, the applications of differentiation, trigonometry, geometry, and then also obviously probability and statistics. Now obviously looking at these five or six topics you can see that they're the biggest sections of the course. They're huge, huge areas of interest. Um, now also as well we all understand that the Leaving Cert exam papers now are in two different sections. We have section A which is about the theory, the background theory of the course which is very much, you, you know pretty much what to expect in the questions that you're going to be asked. Whereas in section B, the context and application section nobody knows what's going to happen there okay generally what will happen in section b the context and application section is that the topics here will be mixed in unique ways okay very very interesting ways so say just to give you an example of that um, in differentiation and in the applications of differentiation in section a they might give you a function and say can you please now find the local maximum or local minimum of this particular function Whereas in section B, in context and applications, they might give you some sort of physical description. It could be the price of a share over a given week of time. So we might have price on the y-axis and time on the x-axis. And we have some share price function, we'll call it P of T. Then obviously over the course of a week or a month or whatever, the share price is going to fluctuate. So what we might be asked is, first of all, where are the local maxima or where are the local minima of the price? We might be asked, at what points in the week is the share price increasing? At what points in the week is the share price decreasing? And what is the, maybe possibly the overall greatest share price over the course of that week? In another practical application, we might be given a situation where we have a right circular cone, and we'd be asked, well, can we fit a cylinder inside that cone? And obviously, yes, we can. There are very many different types of cylinders we could fit inside of the cone, which this little tiny cylinder being one example. However, the Leaving Cert examiner will be very concerned about what is the volume of the biggest possible cylinder that we can fit inside the cone. So for that kind of a question, we have to put on our thinking caps and think about what sections of the course are relevant to this particular question. In actual fact, for this question here, clearly it's about differentiation and the applications thereof. Secondly, it also takes in content from trigonometry and geometry. Okay, so these are the kind of clever questions that the examiner may ask in the Leave Insert. Now also as well, um, before leaving the course, each student who attends the course will be giving a significant number of notes in the form of a manual. Okay, these manuals will contain several different questions, several different worked examples, of the style that you would expect to see in the Leave Insert. So hopefully, first of all, you enjoy your Christmas break, and then I look forward to seeing you when you come to the courses in early January.